What's up everybody? I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on Torque Drift. I have linked my account to the PC so we can be on the PC version with cross-platform and everything available. We're gonna be going in big on the PC version. We got 209,000. We got a thousand gold and if we go to my garage, we should have everything. So make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. All of which are found in the description box below. We do. We have all our pro cars, the M4, and everything here on the PC version. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. All of which are found in the description box below. Let's do it. Let's get to it. So we have everything now in the PC version and we have plenty of money and plenty of gold and we do have all of our beautiful cars. So definitely excited now that there's cross platform play and everything like that. One thing I want to check out, do we have everything on max? We do. Everything's on high, full screen, 200 and looks like 80 some frames. So I think we're good. So let's take a look and see what we can do. Why under construction? Upgraded graphics are coming soon for the track. Okay. Okay, so apparently there's some stuff on here that is not available on the PC, but we're gonna see what we can do here on PC now. We do have the controller out, the Xbox One Elite. That is extremely loud. It's a loud car. Probably should adjust the volume a little bit so I don't blow your headphone users ears out. All right, so we're gonna rock. Did I just hit B? I did hit B. So I'm still trying to figure out how the controller works in the menu. I still use my mouse, but from what it does work in the actual driving. So once again, we're going to be learning the controller again here on Torque Drift, but with the PC side now cross-platform and me having everything on here, it's gonna make this a lot easier to do stuff with you guys for recording aspects, streaming, and stuff like that. So live streams will be coming more and more with Torque Drift, with it being on the PC and cross-platform now. Looks like we're going against um, Matt Fields' vet, Formula D, Long Beach, FD circuit. This could turn out really bad because we know how my dilemma is with a controller. We kick it right up there. We're actually going to Followed cones, we would have gotten a restart because, well, we screwed up. Oh, kick it in. So this, ah, oh, so this is the first time I'm on PC with an actually a tuned. Okay, brakes are very touchy. An actual tuned car. So hopefully we can somewhat gain control with the controller because before we were not on a tuned car or anything like that. That was a terrible run. We're gonna not judge that first run by that, but we're definitely gonna be at a huge disadvantage. So I wasn't in tune cars, it was kind of the oh, beginning of controller thing, so it's gonna be something I'm gonna have to get back used to and get used to the controller again, but now that I have my account and everything, I'm gonna be doing more and more torque drifts. So I know you guys wanna see it, so we're definitely gonna do some more and more torque drift stuff with the PC side open and see that man just goes right through why don't you use the chicane like you're supposed to man oh I think I think I'm understanding how to use the controller now why can I do this on my lead oh, I have clutch kick button too so a little bit more stable on the chase section so I feel like this could be a very good thing and we should be able to uh, get some solid, solid runs here. I'm going to try to get a rematch. Yep, we're going to go for that rematch because totally screwed up my run. Let's see if we can't do our chase in the lead. See, I'm going to actually take the chicane like, you know, an FD driver would. Oh, 
There we go. Gotta be smooth on the steering. Oh, this looks better. Yep. I think I figured out how to drive a controller here on Torque Drift. Oh, God, get on the wall, right on the wall. We just got a clean pass. Now, it wasn't the best run, but way better than the first run, so I'm super excited about that. It wasn't the cleanest, but you know what? We're progressing, and progression is a good thing. So, like I said, there's gonna be a lot more, you know, Torque Drift content coming out with me having my account and everything here on PC. A oh, little bit of wall tap. Not as close as I'd like to be. I probably should be in fourth. But I think I'm getting the feels of a controller. Oh, that was a hard, hard throw into him. So, if you guys are on PC, let me know if you guys are using controller. What are you guys using? Because I'm using my Xbox One Elite and wired into my PC. So I'm very curious what you guys are all using we're gonna no no we're going to uh head back to the lobby and see what other tracks maybe we can run because you know we're going to be building some stuff cali banks infinity circuit mm. i don't know if i'm good enough for infinity circuit but we definitely gonna give it a shot in the m4 and we're gonna see what kind of uh opponent we gonna get and it looks like it's gonna be a 1500 horsepower s14 formula drift Irwindale infinity circuit go right into fourth probably should have went into third but there we go Finally learning how to use a controller. Oh, just a wall tap, but we're still good. We're a little bit off that bank, so we're gonna bring it up a little bit. A little clutch kick, a little left foot braking. Not too bad. So if you guys have watched my other torque trip videos on PC, you guys know I was not the great on the controller at all. So we're getting slowly better. Probably not the best because I'm getting I'm pretty much getting walked on by everybody in today's episode, but I can actually hold the line now, which is way more than I can say for last time we were on the PC side. No, no, gotta catch up. Up shift to fourth. Because we, I would say we would have been into that wall and well, we were just in that wall, unfortunately. So controller drifting is going to be a progression here on the game. Gonna have to fine tune some cars, maybe a little bit different handling and grip characteristics now with using it on a controller. So there's gonna be some tuning and stuff like that here in other episodes because, well, we're definitely gonna need to get these cars dialed in because I can't go just like losing all these times. What happened? Did I, did I just freeze the game? I can't go out here like looking like a complete fool. That is a pretty sweet 14. Looking like a complete fool and uh, losing all the battles because if I'm gonna be running some live tandem battles definitely gonna be wanting to be up in the game did I just freeze my game I think we just froze the game well that's unfortunate so we're gonna reset the game real quick because unfortunately well that's 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 frozen correct account that's the account we wanted so let's go hit up I believe Long Beach one more time Ah, we'll hit up we'll hit up Cali Banks one more time to end this episode off. So we're gonna hit up the Cali Banks section, the Infinity Circuit. Let us drive probably one of my favorite cars, pro cars in the game, Christos Blush's E92 Eurofighter. See if we can handle that on a controller. Can't see my car, but that guy's right there. Cars definitely look amazing here. Odd PC. Cook us right up into fourth gear. And we're gonna see what we can do with this. Nowhere near those clips. But slowly, oh, nope. Oh, that's too hard of a hit. I say slowly relearning a controller is going to be the problem for me. 
So I think this is going to do it for the end of today's episode. We're going to do the chase run, even though that was a horrible lead run. And we just got walked on. And we're going to see what we can accomplish with some more practice on a controller. We may have to go into first person. We may have to drift in first person. That may be what helps us. Oh, man. Way off. So, like I said, that'll do it here for me today. Hope you guys liked the video and back on PC with more torture coming to you guys because I know you guys want it. It's coming back to the channel. As always, I thank you guys for watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.